Nope. Number one, number number one qualifier. qualifier stick shift. <laughs> Told Red Demon I'm coming. Oh, yeah. <laughs> favorites here and from Nebraska uh, from Nebraska Scott Frost we're going back to the championship hell, hell yes <laughs> what is the new one set up this year well we're still we're still running an IAG engine uh, stage four engine short block uh, stage five head we've got uh, prime motoring assembled trans it's still stock gears but they keep refreshing it for me every time I break it turbo wise we just switched over to a precision gen 2 6785 from real street uh, rally sport direct got us the new process west intake manifold trying to the goal with this year is to try to get a little bit more efficiency out of the engine uh, of course junior tunes the car still at junior tune uh, it's making about 1100 just give or take 1100 horsepower on 45 psi this thing didn't have an engine in it two weeks ago so two weeks ago had no engine and we had a brand new turbo the turbo is massive my friend Andrew aka Huggy Fab built the new turbo kit from scratch in my garage over a lot of long nights after work the things are coming together we ran a 901 on a really bad pass tonight and tomorrow we're hoping to go into the eights that's the goal consistent eights and not tear the car up I'd like to drive it on the trailer I'm gonna be doing stick shift class tomorrow I heard what I heard the red demons a little nervous they VA baits in there <laughs> So uh, I'll go talk to Devin about that. They're one of they're one of the best stick shift cars ever, and they uh, they do a really nice job. So I'm looking forward to maybe getting a chance to race next to them for a short period of time. <laughs> See, this car we've always loved this car because we've seen it since it was like stock motor on the street, full interior and everything. And you slowly just made it more and more race car. Yeah. yeah. But you still drive it to Chipotle every once in a while. You know, chicken burrito from Chipotle. <laughs> It's a great Chipotle car. There you go. Yeah. Awesome, man. Well, good luck to, to you this weekend. Hopefully, it. hopefully you can drive it on the trailer at the end of the weekend. That's what we're hoping. Good luck to you, man. Yes. Hell yeah. Oh my God, it's CJ from the internet. Hey, buddy. What's up? How you doing? Good. Yeah. How's the car? It's doing really good. Um, hoping to make a strong pass here for a first test of the day. Perfect. Only got one pass in last night. And I know, it was, it was, it was uh, a stop and go. Yeah, it was pretty rough. The car's on a new setup, so we didn't get what we wanted, but made some adjustments and we'll go from there. Just making a test hit. So, Cletus and Leroy is hoping to run his first seven here. It's probably going to have to happen right now because of the way the weather is. It's really nice right now. I'll feel happy. Oh, he needs racing the unicorn. Perfect. Hey guys, DJ from the internet here. 
Wow, is this what it feels like to be in a real fast car? Yeah. Man, Leroy got drug in that last race. <laughs> so bad he had to lift, I think. Damn. Lifted him. Lifted him. Damn, you can take that? Well, I'm a I missed four guy. Out there again. I missed it farther than freaking. Uh, all the way back home to Alabama. Uh, all the way back home to Alabama. <laughs> Not much, man. Well, I wasn't here earlier, so congrats on your eight. Thank you. What do you think? You got about the same tune-up in there? You uh, turned up a little bit? We put a little bit more in it. The track's kind of getting a little shot up. We had a GTR1 just went in front of our class. And they all have street tires. And then, of course, there was a Corvette with factory, whatever they call them, super sports. And so I told them I was going to wait for something to come from my pit so I could get some tire cars in front of me. And uh, here we are. So, let's see where we go. Good luck, man. Thank you. What's up? What happened on the last Real original. I uh, broke a inner joint on, or inner on the CB. Did you bring extras for that? Uh, no, we actually borrowed one from someone else. The car was 20 minutes away from being loaded on the transport truck. We pulled it apart and got their car back together as the transport driver called. Nice. Now, my car's running. He's going to go to the number seven spot. Hopefully an eight. Hopefully another eight, right? Hopefully we'll just qualify. I don't know. I haven't been paying attention where we're at. So. Good luck, man. Thank you. Car one qualifying. you've ever gone? Yeah, that's my new personal best. And it's a 79 with a what, a what model? 879, 165. Hell yeah. Feels good. Yeah? It was, you were on a pass, like your one-two shift was good, and then yeah. three, and then two-three. Two-three two, wasn't that great. It had it look from the start It looked line. fast. I can show it to you in a minute. It looked fast. Yeah, man. It felt like I got rear-ended by a car when I grabbed second gear. <laughs> <laughs> Hooking and booking. Everybody, all, all your boys are freaking out. V8 bait. Shit, huh? Yeah. Dude! Woo! Dude! Dude! Oh! Hey, this is just day one, right? This is yeah, day well, one. I think we qualified. You qualified. I think we made you're number qualified. One qualifier. Yeah, you're, nope. you're number one, number number one, one qualifier. qualifier stick shift. <laughs> Told Red Demon I'm coming. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Mr. Internet? How are we yes. doing today? I'm doing great. Beautiful day. Number two qualifier. Number two qualifier. Something to be proud of. That's right. Do you know? That? Come on! Do you know who you're racing first round? I don't. Yeah, it depends on how the round three qualifiers go. Oh, good call. Are you, gonna, are you just going to settle with no, the time you we're, have? we're going to save the car for eliminations. Don't want to risk the drive line, so be good. That track is sticky. I yeah. just walked it and about took my shoes yeah. off. Yeah. And just to remind our fans, you actually broke the stock transmission Subaru record yesterday. Yeah, so it's a OEM trans, same as you find on any brand new STI on a dealership lot right now. And we went 879 with it. The car previously held it with 890. Um, a lot of people get confused with White Bullet has six speed or H pattern Subaru record, but you know, we have an OEM stock is a 200 horsepower car we come with, <laughs> so um, it's pretty cool. And we'll just keep trying to go faster. You know, we know it has a lifespan, we'll try not to use it up all the day. Well, good luck to you, man. We'll Thank see you up in the lanes. <laughs> Just 
steady drive away. 870, 167 the speed, quite enough. They run that very tough. one of these monsters here in a second. I heard you had a little nice little wheelie. Yeah, and grab second, that thing. Awesome suspension. Crap. I need to do a little bit. <laughs> so happy they let us do test and tune ahead. My car was on fire. It was hot. Oh, man. Uh, Still, still running. In the semis. Yeah, there's some fast stuff here. This is actually pretty funny. There's four different cars in this class all in the finals. That's true. Civic, Evo, Subaru. It's, the best, class, no it's the best class. It's always the best class. You got the man pedal. But I got a stock trans. I don't know about anybody else. Oh, here we go. <laughs> We're trying to go fast, not slower. So. Yeah. <laughs> he just got run it, done running a six in his DTR. And he had to get up here to run the semifinal. There he is, running with his helmet on. Give him a round of applause, guys. Woo! Guy just ran from the top of the track, quarter mile, with his race suit and the helmet on. That's dedication to the event, and to the team, and to the car. Literally just got done running a six in his GTR and then came over and ran a 836. What's up, guys? Thanks for watching that video. If you have not checked out our merch store recently, there's over 100 items on there with a bunch of new releases. We'll have a link in the description below, so make sure you guys go check that out. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right there and check out these couple videos over here. Also, go ahead and check out our new channel, 1320 Video Uncut. We're going to have a whole bunch of unseen content on that channel right there, so make sure you stay tuned and check that out. We'll see you guys in the next video.